Imagine shipping goods overnight from Oslo to Antwerp at a fraction of the cost of air freight. How many lives could be saved if we were able to more rapidly deliver vital relief supplies in response to natural disasters? The military and civilian logistics markets have seen a surge in the need for the delivery of time-critical, price-sensitive goods. Environmentally friendly solutions to meet this demand are critical to the logistics industry. The Flying Ship Company has taken proven technology harnessing the aerodynamic principle of ground effect to create advanced, uncrewed cargo vessels that fly just over the water. Integrating green technologies with 21st century aerodynamics will dramatically decrease vessel cost, improve energy efficiency, and reduce greenhouse gas emissions. The vessel will leverage existing infrastructure using marinas, beaches, and boat ramps to efficiently deliver goods to thousands of access points. Seen here, our new ground effect demonstration vessel was tested on Lake Elsinore, California in September of 2021. It was designed as a test platform for a variety of systems, including light detection and ranging, or LIDAR sensors, that autonomously operate to keep the vessel in ground effect no more than six feet from the surface. This platform will help us test other sensors and systems as we move forward. The first generation of flying ships will be approximately 12 meters long and will operate within the maritime domain for commercial markets. They will have fully electric engines with a payload of approximately 1,000 kilos and a range of about 500 nautical miles. The first generation flying ships will be semi-autonomous next generation models will be fully autonomous. We aim for full commercialization of the initial variant in three years, followed by larger versions with enhanced range and payload capabilities. Emerging technologies offer sustainable and cost-effective solutions to traditional cargo operations, and Flying Ships has seized on proven science to present better alternatives to the shipping sector. These concepts are now becoming reality.